Nikki, what are you making? Here, just have some. We don't have cereal, dude. Have a pop tart. Want a pop tart? Yeah. Guess he'll starve. I made him a peanut butter jelly sandwich, but he wanted a plate with it. Why you want a plate with the peanut butter jelly? Just hold it and eat it, amigo. It was like peanut butter and jelly would spill all over you. No, I made dude. I made my peanut butter jelly so perfect that the the jelly will not come out of you know the bread. Mm -hmm. It's gonna be in between. Back in my day, I used to always make up my own breakfast. My mom never made our, our breakfast. She always says, I'll make your lunch, I'll make your dinner, but breakfast is you. You decide what you want for breakfast. You want cereal? Go get yourself some cereal. You want to start, you know, getting some eggs on the, you know, stove? You better do that, but you better be careful, boy. But we're about to drop him off in the bed like 10 minutes. I had an okay kind of sleep, you know, but... Yeah. yeah, watching some vlogs right now with Nikki because this is his favorite guy to watch, which is Roman Atwood. This dude looks up to Roman Atwood. So Roman Atwood, if you're watching this, bro, one of your biggest fans. But I'm sure you're not watching this. We gotta go, dude. I got your lunch in there. I got everything for you. I put even you know your special little Scooby snacks that you like, the ones that the kids enjoy. What? Your little Scooby Snacks. What are Scooby Snacks? You know what I'm talking about. Nah, I'm, <laughs> you don't got Scooby Snacks. I just put all your stuff in your your bag. Oh, where's your homework at? Right here. You have your folder? Yes, I have It's right here. Oh, dude. Oh, yeah, your binder. Take that. You cannot take that with you. Dang it, I have to clean that. It's all good. Look at the kitty. Look at that cat. You can't even see. What's up? You're just waking up, huh? See, this dog, he just chills on this couch. He loves this couch. Oh, Rufus. Oh, Rufus, I need him. Here, come on, buddy. Rufus, come on. Come on, Rufus. So every morning and every night, I have to let him go have a chance to go do his thing. All right, bro, I'll be back, man. Why is it blurry? Man, I don't like this camera. One day, I will have a great camera. Until then, you guys are going to have to see the sucky quality of, you know, vlogs. But just know that the content's good, you know? Let's get out of here, bro. Oh, I need my keys. Dang it, I'm all over the place this morning. That's what I get for trying to be a babysitter, you know? Trying to do something a man cannot do. It's a woman's job to be a babysitter. No, it's not. I'm just kidding. Obviously, I don't agree with that because I'm a babysitter. And I'm a oh, this, this is heater. Hi. Ooh, feel that? Where's your sweater and jacket? Man, I didn't even notice you didn't have a sweater. Are you cold? Sure. It's I'm cold. cold. My hands are shaking. The vlog's like super shaking right now. Do you feel it warming up? No. No, huh? This is not working. I just feel cold air. Try rubbing the engine. Rubbing, rubbing the engine? You said, you said rubbing the engine? No, I didn't. What'd you say? You said, no, you said rubbing the engine. How do you rub the engine, Nikki? No. I'm sure when I play this back, you're gonna, it's going to say, try to rub the engine. I don't know what you said, Nikki. Sure, you know a term I don't know then. Because that's something that I've never heard of, rubbing the engine. I didn't say rubbing. What did you say? Rubbing. What? Rev. Revving. Revving. Oh wow, oh, I almost ran her over. <gasps> that was suck. 
Yes, go ahead. Y'all can go. That's my turn. I just don't like dropping off people in schools, you know? Because it's just, look, look at all these cars. Ooh, Tesla. Tesla, oh, that's a nice car. And a Mercedes. And a Mercedes. And a BMW. Whoa. And another Mercedes. It's just a ton of cars. It's, it's, it's insane, you know? It drives me crazy. It gives me anxiety. I'm gonna, like, it was really, 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 really. You understand what I said? And mom calls this place the minefield. She calls it the minefield? What? It is the minefield. I'm gonna have to drop you off here. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, we might be able to go in there, dude. But yeah. there's a ton of cars. Wait up, let's see. There's only three cars in front of us. Only three cars in front of us? Oh, there's one. All right, we'll figure this out. Then I'll just drop you off in a little bit, man. I was trying to basically drop them off right here. This little thing. But I'm going to drop them off in a little Oh, heck no. I should have dropped you. Look at all these cars. I we can pull up, Joe. I know, but look at how long it's going to take. Look at all these cars, man. I could have just dropped you off in that corner. Probably you could have made some money, you know, while before you even... Never mind. No. Never mind. Let me stop talking. Yeah. Stop <laughs> talking. <laughs> oh, no. It's actually quick. All right, Nikki. Hey, eat your lunch. I've been at the house just chilling, editing the first half or first part of this vlog, and I'm realizing that I'm not really in a good mood. You guys can tell how many pieces I had of pie, pumpkin pie. I had all these cookies right here. There were six of them. There's one left. That that and many other things you guys hey guys i'm just not right now in a good mood you know reason being i had a lot of things i wasn't i wasn't supposed to yeah i'm just not feeling good you guys up here That's how I'm feeling. It's not that I'm just... <sighs> if you're always comfortable, then you're never gonna do anything in life because you're always gonna be comfortable. You're never gonna take risks. And yes, one day I will be on top and I'm telling you this right now to let you guys know that I am not gonna let my emotions take control of me. I'm just gonna let, you know, I'm gonna let it do its course. I'm gonna let it go through this, however you say, basically, I'm gonna, you know, not ignore it, but I'm not gonna let it define me. If you stuck around and watched this entire thing, you deserve to know this. My music always reflects my mood. If I'm playing uppity music, I'm feeling uppity, you know, I'm feeling like, yeah, but if I'm playing sad music, I'm like, dang. If I, you know, just keep in mind my music reflects my mood. Thank you guys. Love you guys. Peace out.